so this principle is you don't drown because you fell in the water. You drown because you stayed there. I don't remember where I first heard this, but it wasn't anything that I invented. But it, it spoke to me because people end up drowning. They say, well, you didn't know how to swim. Right. But even if you knew how to swim, <laughs> eventually, if you stayed in that water, you're going to drown. Nobody can swim forever. Nobody can. So when you, that's just a, a metaphor, but when you, when you think about what's happening in your life, you're not really, you're not doomed because you fell in the proverbial water and you, and you can't swim. It's because you stayed there. You made no effort to change your life. You made no effort to better yourself. In a fight or in a, in a grappling match, for example, <clears throat> if, you're, if you give up the very minute something goes south, you're not going to really be uh, very successful at it. One of the great things about training jujitsu and sambo and all these things is it puts you in bad situations all the time, all the time, and it forces you to deal with those things. You have to figure out how to, to first not lose. That's another principle we've talked about. Well, now how do I better myself? By making the choices that help me. And I don't have to accept this as my fate. There's a fantastic story um, about a gentleman who he, I believe is in New York City opera now and you can see the story about him he was a young guy who who really ran kind of uh he, he didn't his life did not start well I think he had a tragic family home life he ended up getting in reform school I think he was putting in reform school and he had a teacher that went and said look I know things are bad now but you don't have to this doesn't have to define you you can come out of this and you can make something of yourself the guy ended up being an opera singer in New York City and that, that's just such an inspiring story. You can look him up. His name escapes me. But he didn't accept, you know, it, he, he fell in the water, basically. But he didn't stay there. And a little encouragement went a long way with that guy. So he's a, stories like that are inspiring to me. I'm not inspired by victimhood. I don't find there's honor in that. I don't find, I, in fact, the people who promote that really don't have any real belief in the human spirit. And I have a tremendous belief in it. I think people can overcome amazing odds. No, the world's not fair. No, things aren't always going to work out for you. But you don't drown because you fell in the water. You drown because you stayed there. So if you feel like you fell in the proverbial water, find a way out. There will be a way out. You just have to find it. And it will come to you. But don't give up on it. Just keep pushing until it gives. And you'll come out of it. And you may find that that very thing that you thought was going to be the worst thing in the world turned out to be great. So you don't drown because you fell in the water, you drown because you stay there.